Hi guys, here I am with the rocket stove working in the workshop. I'm going to step back here. This is my install. Um, basically, I have a small area in this garage, so I built a thermal bench over here. And uh, this is just the frame of it so far. I've got it all plumbed. You can see the rocket stove here. I stuffed it full of just some sticks and stuff and not even any major wood just stuff I found around in the yard and uh, as you can see it's happily burning away there just on sticks and twigs and I have a piece of split oak um, and it's working really nice my thermometer here at the top I'll zoom in here I'm getting almost 400 degrees there off the top and here's my thermal mass there's my clean out there's my clean out and then I run this aluminum pipe into this little L shaped and I'm going to cover this fill this with a uh, round river stone so that the sharp points don't puncture through the aluminum pipe and this is three pieces of eight foot length that I just pulled apart and kind of wrapped around in a big coil and I'll fill this full of gravel I lined the thing with um, foil covered insulation so it doesn't pump heat into my outside walls and also I put foil down on the slab floor because I really don't want to pump a bunch of heat into my slab or have the cold come up um, and then I lined it with sheet metal and um, I've actually got a large piece of one inch thick epoxy top that's going to go on top of this and um, this is that thick mosquito net or uh, chicken wire netting it's a uh, metal coarse metal netting that'll hold my gravel in but allow air to get up through through the stone and I may drill some holes in the uh, epoxy top that will sit down on top of it for the bench uh, so we can have natural natural air convection through there um, so I took some temperature readings and right about there just past the clean out T there I'm getting 150 degrees and outside my flu going out looks like it's uh, 1 120 It's about 120 right there. I suspect it'll be even a lot less than that um, once the thermal mass is in there and all that stone absorbs extra heat. But I can put my hand on it. So that's pretty much my thermal bench. It's uh, nothing real fancy. I'll take you outside to see the flu. And uh, you can see what I did there.